Hello friends and welcome to Brainna Creations. In today's video, I want to take you on my garden tour. This is me prepping my garden sometime in January, late January of 2024. So I purchased some sand in these sacks. And basically what I was using or what I started with, uh, the buckets I had, um, due to the hammer turn, some of them dried up, but I was, I was able to regrow them because I had to water the plants and everything. But this is summary of what it looked like as at end of January of 2024. But right now, this is what it looks like. I've been able to take advantage of the sands, some containers, and then the garden beds. These garden beds were originally for flowers, but um, some of the flowers died. So I decided to, you know, instead of wasting the space and then planting flowers that are not beneficial to me, even though they give me oxygen, but I mean, I can have both, you know, eat my cake and have it, have my plants. I have from corn to greens, to water leaves, to scent leaves, to curry leaves, to spinach, ogu, peppers, and all of that. Garden eggs. Yeah, some of them, they didn't thrive so well. This is what I made for my ogu. And they are still coming up. Um, and I hope that they do very well. And I have my um, spinach growing on my corn. I have this corn. Um, I may be, I'm kind of regretting planting the corn here because it's taking a lot of space. I have some wheat going and I'm going to take care of that, guys. Look at how green and rich this spinach look. And the corn, see the leaves so dark green. Yeah, I make use of some organic ways to, that is my spinach growing on my corn plant or corn tree. Yes, I use um, organic fertilizers and hopefully I start my compost. I've been thinking about it. I'll be sharing with you guys. I made some videos in the past on how to um, plant in your, garden, in your containers and I'll be linking that to this video if you don't already, if you've not seen them before now. Here is these peppers, garden eggs were infested with some insects and luckily i've been able to get rid of them but it really humbled me i used to wonder why some green peppers were very expensive but now i know you know and then i have here my miracle plant coming and spinach spinach is very good because you can replant it if you buy it from the supermarket that's my scent leaf if you buy from the supermarket you just need to use the stem and use the leaves and the stem you put it in your soil and you're good to go i have some scent leaves i want to read transplant this what um bitter leaf that i pl i showed in my video uh is doing well needs to be transplanted my purple needs to be transplanted i have here ginger which uh, i need to create some space for guys so what's your excuse guys that you don't have a backyard garden the reason that what motivated me really is because i still have some purple going right in some other spaces is because some, when you buy vegetables they get to spoil before you even use it sometimes in the fridge if you, if you don't store well but with this this is my moringa plant going hopefully it turns out into a big tree and i'll have i'll harvest as many seeds as i need which is very very good the leaves can also be used in salads and um, make um, you can make your tea with it you can do different things, grind it and add to your pups and all that. These are all the flowers that are on the bed. I have my purple tree also growing. These ones are beginning to bring out seeds. I think this is the male one. I really don't know. Over time, I'm going to tell. It's going to feel good harvesting from um, these plants, you know, guys. So this video is really to help you, motivate you. I make videos on healthy living, budgeting and great recipes. And also how to manage your finances if you have issues with it or you need help. I have here all the rest of my corn. I know this place needs some help. I need to weed them. But I also have some um, yams in sacks. Yes, I grow yams in sacks. You can also grow potatoes if you have the space. So what's your excuse, guys? Don't forget to subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. And then comment down below if you have questions or suggestions. And then share with your friends. If you subscribe, don't forget to click the bell icon so that you can get notifications anytime I share a new post. I'll be seeing you guys in another video. Until then, stay safe. Bye.